Well, all right, so I want to talk about this Tide Pod Challenge that I've been hearing about over the last couple months. I mean, what a ridiculous thing to do. And all these internet challenges that, that you hear about are, are so stupid. I mean, I mean, you hear about some of these things, and every time th- these things happen, they, some, some idiot ends up killing themselves. Uh, I, I mean, even whether it's like the Ice Bucket Challenge, people died from that. Or um, they had the Cinnamon Challenge. <laughs> people died from that you had um um oh another stupid one where people stuck like a condom up their nose and then they you you know it went through into their mouth or some bullshit like that i mean what the fuck i mean i really don't get the appeal on that i, I, I mean why don't we have challenges about good things where you can't kill yourself How about a challenge of you know oh, let's see let's see what person can lose the most weight or what person can give the most money to charity? No, it's doing all these risky things. The cinnamon challenge where you could fucking choke yourself to death. And then there's then, then there's morons who are like planking off of 20-story buildings and, and, and killing themselves. And I, I mean, people are just so dumb. Uh, some people, not, not, not all, not, most, you know, people are rational human beings who, uh, don't do dumb shit like that, but there are a lot of people out there who take dumb risks, and those are the people who are on, you, you know, the, the, the TV show, you, you know, you see them online and fail videos, just doing the most ridiculous things, hurting themselves intentionally, or, you know, doing risky things for no reason. I mean, I mean, you got to do risky things in life. You know, you got to drive. Driving's risky. You know, I mean, like thirty thousand people die every year in car accidents. But I mean, you got to drive to to you know have a life. You got to go to work. You got to go to wherever you got to go. Um, but then you know, so you already have enough you know necessary risks you have to take as a human being. First off, but don't compound on those risks by doing dumb shit. And then I see online articles about this Tide Pod challenge where uh, n- newspapers or media organizations are like, well, Tide isn't <clears throat> isn't taking these dangerous chemicals out of their products, uh, nor should they. Just because there's a bunch of dumbasses out there, uh, Tide should change their formula, should change their product. And, and take chemicals out because people are misusing it, knowingly misusing it, and being dumb fucks. I mean, this is, it's so stupid how, uh, yeah, there's a lot of dangerous shit in Tide. But it's not meant to be eaten. It's not meant to, it's not meant to be an edible product. Oh, I mean, I, 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 I just can't fathom this. And, and, and you got people doing this, all, all these challenges, all these fucking ja- challenges. Um... You know, like, when I was in 6th or 7th grade, you didn't have this shit. I mean, you didn't have all these, you know, oh, it's a, it's a challenge, too, a challenge. So if you don't do it, you're like a loser or something. You know, if you if you actually want to live and, and not put your, you know, uh, body at risk for death or injury, you're, you're, you, you, you fail the challenge. Um, so I never, I, 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 I'm not a participant in any of these uh, fucked up things. Uh, but it really shows how there's a there's a large portion of society now who's just very dumb, low IQ, no common sense uh, behavior, um, and, and it's uh, and, and I mean you see a you know a ton of people too, you know just uh, not paying attention to things in in life that really matter, but instead focusing on bullshit like this <coughs> that doesn't that doesn't matter. So so there you go. And I really got mad again when I saw the article, an article online that said, well, Tide's not, you know, Tide says they're not taking, you know, the, the bad shit out of their product. You know, like somehow implying this is all Tide's fault for, for you know, putting, yeah. you know, And, and then, you know, what's going to happen? They're going to take the shit out of their product and then, and then it's not going to work. Then you're going to have dirty fucking clothes, people. You know, so you, you could thank the dumb fucks. Who, who are eating, eating soap, eating chemical soap, you could thank them because probably in a couple months you're going to have fucking dirty clothes all the fucking time, you know, um, so yeah, 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 you know, I'm just going to go inside right now and pop a couple Tide Pods, yeah, that, that, that's really, that's really smart, uh, so, um, so there you go, people, that's all I got to say about that.